Hello everyone. Uh, today we're going to look into how you are going to set up with your personal MYP design portfolio. So uh, I've created uh, a template for everybody to follow so that it's easier for everybody to set up. Uh, you may also use your own um, you, uh, your ideas into how you are going to create this one as long as all the items are in there and you are able to upload all your photos and also videos uh, and also reflections on how you are going to present your MYP design portfolio. Now, uh, for this, uh, this is the example. So this is an example in which uh, everybody will be able to make a copy of the, the website. So here, uh, later on, you need to write your name. So this is the published website on our uh, Google sites. Uh, write your name and then write about yourself. Okay, just uh, answer these questions. And then, as you may see, that it is already cataloged into grade seven, eight, nine, and 10, so forth. So hopefully you will be able to use this one until the end of your MYP years. Now, uh, as you can see here, grade seven, uh, this is an example. In each example, there is a template, okay? There's a, a layout on in which you, how you can add in. So unit one, you add the description, unit two, etc. cetera, okay? So uh, all of the units here are, are, the templates are the same. You just need to edit them. Now, uh, to look into this, so you can see here that on the right side of the document, there would be different uh, layouts that you can add into your document but uh, especially you need to go to the pages, okay? In the pages, you are, you are able to locate which, uh, which unit you're going to add in. So when you just click on it, it can give you a, a link into which you can upload, you can select from the drive or YouTube or calendar, etc. Now, uh, you may also look into insert and then if you have a lot of photos, I would recommend you to to use image carousel, but you need to upload all of the, the image that you want to use as a carousel. Now, uh, there's table of content, collapsible. You may explore all of this, okay? Uh, on how to divide your template. Okay, now, um, if you like, you can only change the themes of the, the template, but you may not able to change the, the text, okay? Now, here, uh, you may only make a size of it, change the size or uh, big, small, depend because this is the limitation for the Google Sites. Now, once you are able to do so, I will be I will link the um, the the shared file, a shell for shell folder, and then it will show like this. As long as you log into your account. It will show like this. I created a make copy of this of the Google site. So this one. So you open up or right click it, and then just click make a copy, and then it will go to your your drive. Okay. So make sure that you make a copy. Right click on the file and make copy of it. Okay. Now um, to go back. Once you are able to go in, you will be able to have your own uh, templates, okay? Templates, so uh, change the name here. Uh, you can go back again to the home, okay? You can change the background, 
okay? Change the background, upload the photo, or just select, or change it. And then um, if you're a grade seven, okay, I've added um, a syllabus here, and then you can add in more information if you like, okay? And then uh, for our first unit, um, if you took picture on, on process that you have, uh, I would like you to have more on the process journal. So it should look like this, okay? Once that you have process journal, okay? So these are examples. Uh, most, most of you have created or take photo of the air, paper airplane that you are going to be flying. And then maybe you can write uh, some reflections on the, how did you start with the process. And then afterwards, this is the reflection, how would you improve the project? If you want to change this one, you may do so as long as you have different types of, uh, different types of information or pictures or videos that you created during the process of your design. Okay, so make sure that all of your documents are organized and then later on I will be asking your uh, your uh, website address. So check your ATL organization. So this is your ATL organization. Okay, good.